Merry Christmas. For some, Christmas sparks memories of a harsh, cold, reality-striking nightmare of a holiday. But I've always remembered Christmas as the warmth of a fire. The sweet, salivating smell of cinnamon rolls fresh off of the stove, the crinkling of wrapping paper, and the laughs and tears of my family. All good tears, of course. I have a lot of memories. Some of mine are lost, just black voids. These are emotionless, mindless points that mark gaps in my recollection. Most memories consist of my mom, an unapologetically extroverted, stubborn, and quite frankly, genius woman, and I love her. Most of mine are filled up with my dad. He is patient, he is kind, he is also stubborn, and I strive to be him. I strive to be even a fraction of the man he is, and I love him. Memories are great one by one, but together, they make a story. Together they make up my story. My memories made me. Dad, last summer we went to Florida. And for a long moment, it was just you, me, the ocean, and the sun. The ocean tried to eat us, the sun tried to burn us, but none of that really mattered because we were there together and it was so much fun. The way the waves splashed against our backs, toppling us like skyscrapers, left us roaring with laughter as we attempted to push ourselves to our feet for another tossle with the waves. Splash upon splash, crash upon crash, we ran back into those waves and for a brief moment, there were no worries, there were no thoughts. It was just you, me, and the ocean. Mom? You've always had my back, and I've always had yours. The summer before my freshman year saw the two of us together. Every single week, we would scrounge around our house looking for a couple of quarters. And every single week, we would go to the movies. Not only did this constant repetition really help me grow in my love for filmmaking, but also helped me grow with my love for you. It was just the two of us, and a lot of times these theaters were empty. Of course, there was that one time that there was that crazy guy with his, you know, long, frazzled hair and his disgusting, alcohol-ridden breath. He might have sat unusually close to us, but that was a really, really, really fun day. The motherly love that you really showed me on those days taught me a lot about parenting, but more importantly, taught me a lot about being a good human. So mom, dad, I love both of you and I love all of the memories I've had with you and I wouldn't trade it for the world. So from the bottom of my heart, Merry Christmas. I love you guys.